Hi, it's me again. I toned down my um, lipstick and now I'm going to do um, a really quick um, false lash application just because I have a couple more minutes and I'm like, why not, right? So I don't know how many of you, you know, tried to do the false lashes or like the lashes, but I've got plenty of them. And um, I recommend the duo, the um, surgical adhesive and the lack only. I hate the one in white. I think it sucks. I don't know if that's what I'm going to be saying, but I think it doesn't work very well. Okay, so I'm going to apply, um, let me see here. I think I'm going to do a corner on one. And if I have time, I'll do uh, something else on the other. So basically, I have my duo. Here we go. In black, dark tone, it said. Did you see? There we go. And um, you're going to apply it directly to the, here's my corner. There we go. And you're going to apply it directly to the edge. And of course, you know, if you don't already know, um, lashes are, um, you can wear them more than once. You don't have to throw them away. I love lashes. I have lots of them. And you just want to kind of put like a thin layer to the edge. You can see that. There we go. And you want to kind of like waft it out. You want to kind of get it gummy. Yeah. And um, so basically, can you speed that up a little bit? <laughs> <coughs> and sometimes, um, if you're doing it yourself, you know, like Matt teaches you to like look in a mirror and look down. I don't know if that's really that easy. I had to actually go into a mirror and do it myself. And um, I'm gonna go ahead and put it in. And um, bear with me here. I'm gonna try to. Hey, Chop, if you can see me. Sorry, I have a baby sleeping. I'm limited on time here. Okay, so I'm just gonna actually just go right into the lash with this. Pretty simple. And if you want to, you know, um, give it an extra reinforcement, go ahead and just, you know, get an end of a brush or a um, tweezer and just kind of push it in. You can see, it kind of looks like, um, you know, if you're familiar with the MAC Lash of 20, which is the corner, but um, you see it's not exactly a 20, it's just a good corner lash, but um, it's uh, not fantasy lash. So I have that one. And I'm going to angle this so you can see it. So. And you have to be really careful when you um, my lashes because even some of the MAC ones aren't that great. Um, you really you want to look for something with a band that's really thin, not thick at all because it's just not going to sit right. You really have to put a bunch of glue and a whole bunch of work into it and it's a really big thing. Mm -hmm. So I'll show you a couple of different ones that you want to and don't want to buy. <coughs> I'll buy them just because I'm crazy and I have a fetish for lashes, not because I should be because they don't all work. <coughs> um, ELF um, sells um, good lashes. Ardell um, sells good lashes. And those, again, are just, you know, like a thin band, really easy to apply. Um, I'll show you if you see more like fantasy lash. See how thick that is? Bad. I haven't even tried to put them on because I just don't want to because I'm scared that it's going to take forever and I'm going to get a little frustrated. And even for somebody who's been doing makeup, I've been doing makeup like 10 years, those lashes, sometimes, when you're in a rush and you just want to get out of the house and you go to wherever you're going, quite a thing. Let me see if I can show this other lash. I'm going to clean the glue off the end of it. And it's a lot thinner. I have my ELF on, but I can show you those. And so, you know, let me see. You can see it's not as thick, but for a better one, it's going to be the ELF one. Okay, I'll show you. <coughs> um, <coughs> the ELF lashes that I recommend for the uh, dramatic lash. And let's see if I can. That's what I like for you. 
I'm not really into anybody's lash glue or anything like that. I still use a glue with everything. But if you can see, there's really not a band on this lash, and that's the best one. I mean, there's a band, you know, but it looks clear. Those are the ones that are the best. Or the easiest to work with, I think, you know. Not everything is pretty easy to work with, though. I'll keep that in mind. So I just bought, like, a ton of them. You can get lashes for a dollar. You can get, um, I, I sound like I'm here, like, promoting products. Ah! But, um, two dollars for two of lashes from here last. And, you know, I like them. Okay, so then another lash. You see, my little box of lashes. Mm -hmm. My box of lashes. Um, to use this lash for you. Right there. And then there. I got the wrong one with the wrong end. And I'm going to do this real quick. We'll have to end up with another video, right? And again, you're just going to take it and put it all over the edge. Just like that. And you're going to wave it out. If you can see the glue, can you see? There you go. And we're just going to wave it out like inside. <coughs> you get the process and you blow on it a little, put it a little dummy, quicker. And you just want to tap it because it just does not like yours better. And then, you just going to actually, I just, I just really, honestly, the put it right on there. And when you're buying um, your lashes for the first time, go ahead and make sure that you're fitting them. Um, so, you know, um, make sure before you actually glue them on, you measure them to size. And if you have to adjust them, you cut off any end. You cut from the end, not from the front. And of course, I probably made that look, I don't know, if you're used to putting the lashes or not, but it's pretty simple. I think it's pretty simple. You know, I recommend anything with uh, lashes or liquid. Uh, take a couple of minutes, you know, if it's your first time, and do it in the mirror. And, um, I don't know if you do this too. But, um, don't be rushed, you know. You're really not going to get the best results if you're rushed. You really got to play with that a little bit if it's your first time. But anyways, I have two different sets of lashes on. If you really want to go ahead, um, they say you shouldn't. I do because I don't want them to look completely fake. I want them to look real and guys. So I'm going to go ahead and just kind of the lashes kind of in together with a little bit of mascara. It doesn't ruin the lash, you know. And um, if I was wearing heavier makeup, I would go ahead and take like a liquid liner and then go ahead and reinforce the lash line with a liquid on top. But right now it actually is pretty good because I still have the night pieces from before and then from the other lash. Um, it's just really sitting on my line. So um, I really don't have anything to worry about. But again, if you can... And there you go. So <clears throat> that's another lap application done. So I'll see you soon. Or I'll see you or you see me or see you later. <laughs>